Erie for Ukraine receiving a $20,000 check after a local business hosted a fundraiser to support the campaign. Chelsea Swift joins us now with more about how one personal connection led to thousands of dollars being raised. Chelsea. Jill, that's right. One local business raised more than $20,000 for Erie for Ukraine. Erie for Ukraine receiving more than $20,000 after one local company's fundraiser. Huffis Auto and Truck Supply representatives choosing to support the Erie for Ukraine campaign. One Huffis employee and Erie for Ukraine organizer says he's proud of the Erie community. It's been overwhelming to see the amazing support from the Erie community, something that we did not really expect, but people just keep calling, keep coming, and, and, and keep putting their time with volunteering and uh, monetary donations and also just the items and, and, and and physical items they brought that were able to send and help those people out. Bogdanit says he was born in Ukraine and he and his family moved to Erie when he was six years old. We know relatives that live there. We have uh, churches that were connected with there that, that are working there. So yeah, it's, 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 it's probably closer to us than anybody else, obviously, and that's why we're so passionate about it. The vice president of Hovis Auto and Truck Supply says he's grateful members of the community were united in their support for the people of Ukraine. Everybody had the same belief that they wanted to affect some type of change, some type of help, and they see it every night, so they were they were just so generous. Havis says when he learned about the campaign, he knew they needed to contribute to the cause. You see the, the poor children, and your heart goes out to them. And Janati's church in the area was already a great conduit by which to reach those people. The last Erie for Ukraine collection is this Saturday, April 30th. For more information, head to our website, yourerie.com. Jill? Okay, Chelsea Swift, thank you.